tell me, how many entries did you have in this year's film festival? We have hundreds and hundreds. It depends on how you count because we have, we also run these Golden Gate Awards, which are kind of these international prizes. It ends up being probably between four and five thousand films, including shorts, features, documentaries, animation that come into the organization. So one of the things that we do is kind of educate just normal people about film festivals. So can you tell us how many films are being viewed in the last in the next ten days? Well, there's, uh, we have about 80 to 90 feature films, which makes us a kind of a moderately sized festival on that level. We actually like our audiences to be able to see most of what we show here if they're really committed. Um, different than some of the other larger festivals where you, there's no way you could actually see even half the films in the festival. Um, this seems to be the Bay Area way. Um, we also show a lot of shorts. We uh, have a co competition around that as part of our Golden Gate Awards, and we're very proud that we are actually championing um, short form makers. We actually think that's in many ways the future of this world, as we uh, as our attention spans perhaps decrease a little bit with the uh, with the internet. So, have you seen any films that were sleepers that you're pretty surprised about? Well, actually, it's amazing. The um, this this in this festival, our opening film, our closing film, and our centerpiece are all first time filmmakers which is unprecedented for this event. And in fact, the Closing Night film was only just premiered in the last couple of days in New York and is coming to us basically fresh out of the, out of the, uh, out of the oven. And uh, it's a great film. And so I think that was the one that surprised us the most. It's called Alex of Venice, uh, directed by actor Chris Messina, very well-known character actor, with an incredible performance from Don Johnson. Wow. And so that's coming, I know, and he's amazing in it. He plays a kind of aging actor who's uh, sort of confronting mortality and, um, and his, you know, and, and, and his, his family and their, and their role in the world. It's really a beautiful film. And I think um, one that I think people are gonna take away a lot of uh, really deep emotions from. So can you tell us how people can buy tickets or get involved with the film festival or even become a member? Sure, of course. It's all on our website, so please please join it. You need to type in San Francisco Film Festival or it's sffs.org. Fantastic. And congratulations on your first year. Any surprises for this first year for you? I'm just having a great time rolling with the punches and seeing what happens. So far, it's been great.